from the KATC Weather Lab. Here's Bradley's forecast. All right, well, hopefully everyone was uh, able to enjoy the sunny weather out there today, at least at some point. It was definitely much welcomed after the showers and storms we saw out there yesterday. And it's going to stay nice, at least for one more day, but the clouds are going to be back on Tuesday going into Wednesday. And with that, uh, the return of some rain chances, potentially some severe weather as well. But there's going to be some obstacles in that forecast, so we'll try to break it down in just a second. But first, let's set the stage with the satellite radar coming. Composite. And again, all is quiet across the deep south. Again, nothing but blue skies in Acadiana today. Very comfortable temperatures, actually mild. Got into the mid 70s uh, this afternoon and we'll be pushing the low to mid 70s uh, again, at least for one more day. But uh, we are going to be watching a storm system coming out of the northwest tomorrow and uh, that will bring the potential for at least uh, severe weather across portions of the deep south on Tuesday. So here's how it plays out with the graph model again. We are cool overnight tonight, even chilly by tomorrow morning, upper 40s to lower 50s. So uh, most of you probably needing uh, at least a light jacket out the door first thing tomorrow morning. Uh, some clouds overnight tonight as well, but, but again, nothing that's going to be producing rain or anything like that. And it's back to sunny skies throughout our Monday. It's going to be a really nice day. Again, temperatures topping out very comfortably, low to mid 70s into the afternoon. Winds very light, only at around three to six miles per hour hour may briefly get into the mid uh, to uh, mid 50s uh, overnight Monday going into Tuesday, but temperatures actually rising into the 60s by daybreak there on Tuesday as skies uh, clouds are going to be building across the area. Suddenly winds bringing in that Gulf moisture as well. And again, going to have clouds in place on Tuesday. Also looks likely of a uh, capped atmosphere and for what simply what that means if storms want to develop and grow vertically, they have to overcome that cap and that's a big if at this point. Notice the model not showing a whole lot of convection here uh, in Acadiana there on Tuesday, so we could see somewhat of a lack of storms, but nonetheless, any storms that do get going on Tuesday, uh, it's going to have a lot of energy to work with and uh, potentially could be on the strong to perhaps severe side. You can see this, the model pinpointing that over into Mississippi northern part parts of the state come Tuesday afternoon. So we'll see how that plays out. It stays mild mid 70s, but we will be turning cooler uh, for the second half of the week, especially on Thursday. Speaking of that severe weather risk I have tonight there on the right banner. This is actually for Tuesday, not tonight, uh, but going into Tuesday, the Storm Prediction Center does have most of Acadiana already locked in for a level two out of five risk uh, to see severe storms. But notice that risk a little bit greater as you get farther off to the north across the arc Miss and then extending up into uh, Tennessee. That's where wind shear uh, is going to be a little bit higher. So again, we'll see how it plays out. Uh, a lot of obstacles in that forecast or a lot of variables, I should, should say, uh, in that forecast. But uh, nonetheless, uh, at least a return of some rain chances Tuesday going into early Wednesday. We are chilly overnight tonight. Again, uh, low to mid 40s for the overnight low northern portions of Acadiana, upper 40s to near 50 degrees along the I-10 corridor and pretty much similar values there across the uh, coastal parishes. After that chilly start, again, it will be mild tomorrow afternoon as we see temperatures pushing into the lower and middle 70s with lots of sunshine to go around. So we'll go 50 for that projected low, at least here in Lafayette overnight tonight. Fair skies initially, but uh, clouds uh, will be building overnight, but again, nothing Nothing that's uh, going to be producing rainfall. Most of you uh, again a light jacket first thing tomorrow morning. Otherwise, you'll be able to lose it pretty quickly because we're in the low to mid 70s tomorrow afternoon. It's going to be a mild day, but a beautiful day. Lots of sunshine. Winds will be light out of the northeast only at around three to six miles per hour. Tuesday into Wednesday again, rain chances at around 50 to 60 percent. The potential for some severe storms as well. Again, if the storms are able to develop throughout the day on Tuesday and then behind that front early on Wednesday, we are going to be cooler as we see highs returning to the upper 50s and lower 60s on Thursday. And it looks like Thursday morning will actually be in the upper 30s and lower 40s. Taylor. Gotta love that wild card weather, Bradley.